your engine was on the scene first? Yes, sir. And what did you, what did you see when you got there? Um, the call came out about 5.30 in the morning. Um, and we'd actually been up all night and the call really didn't sound like anything, but as we're driving on scene, you just saw the flames. And as our apparatus got in position, you heard the heart-wrenching screams of the family. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Is that, 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 that's something that you train for, but I guess no matter how many times you see that or hear that, you, you can't possibly get used to that. No, and I've never seen something this bad before where people are that much trouble. They're on the third floor balcony and the fire's just starting to, to lick their balcony. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I'm trying to put myself in your shoes. When did, did it sink in that you actually caught a baby? You were the, you, wait, because there were two, weren't right. there? Oh, we have to, we have to back up. <laughs> there was a baby that was thrown first, right? Right, so we, um, I yelled at my, my driver to get a ladder in position. And we had one of our colleagues go up and he got a, the twin baby girl, brought her down. And I went up and I was, planning on getting on the porch with the family, helping them on the ladder. But as I'm going up the ladder, uh, I look up, make kind of eye contact with the mom and start seeing a blue blanket falling. And I knew it was the other baby. So I just prayed at that point, God, let me catch this baby. And you're on the ladder. Yeah, I'm on a ladder. How, how old was the baby? Four weeks old. Four weeks. And this might be a rumor, is it true that the baby was sleeping and never woke up? It never cried. All the other children were screaming, of course, but this baby, I don't think it ever woke up. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. So. I mean, if that's not a miracle, thank God for you and, and your efforts. Um, it's, it's, it's incredible. Your whole family is firefighters? Yeah, uh, for the most part, my, my grandfather actually started the Cab Fire Department. Look at in that. 1948. Um, there, there in the picture, you see, um, that's actually my uncle on the, uh, on the far left side. He was a retired deputy chief at the Cab Fire Department, and my dad retired as a captain there. Incredible. Do you keep replaying the, the catching of the children over and over in your mind? I mean, it's, I, I, I can't catch a baseball, much less a child. I mean, I, I just can't, I, I've, I've watched it 100 times. I can't, I can't get over that. It's amazing.